What's going on everybody? Welcome back to this episode of G4 Outdoors. Today we're going to be demonstrating this product, the Toro Universal Gutter Cleaning Kit. Going for a walk like I'm headed to the lake, looking for a place to go, cast my life away. When I'm on the water, only time I ever feel sane. Nod your head to what I'm saying if you understand my pain. We was looking for a crappie kitty cat or just a bass. Hold him up inside my life, all golden crispy for a snack. Now my boat's broke again, no reason for me to knock it. Chalk it up to Smithville, money straight out my pocket. Man, now, people always ask, G4 Outdoors, why are you guys always on the water? Always. Because that's where we're at peace. You got peace somewhere. Find me on the water. That's, that's where, where I'm, I'm at, at peace. peace. Now the boat's up and running, so I'm back out on the lake with some friends that I met up on the lake the other day. Now as you listen to the song, it's probably got you in a trance, but understand that these crappies do not stand a single chance. So as I turn around, I got a crappie on the hook. Watch me scream at the top of my lungs to make you look. Yo, that ain't a crappie. That's a big old bass. Watch you breach out the water, make a big old splash. The fish won't stop fighting. This battle's been so hard. Everybody's straight soaked like rides at a water park. Now we finally calm down. I got him up on the scale. Okay, Ten so this pounds, is six ounces, almost come. a killer whale. I'm calling everyone I know. Even people in jail say you gotta check this fish. I got him here. <laughs> Okay, so being as this does say that this is a universal kit, it, you know, a lot of you have misinterpreted that I am solely doing Toro products. That's completely not the case. I do products reviews for everybody. And being as this is a universal kit, we're actually gonna find out whether it's universal across all product brands or basically just all Toro brands. So let's get to unboxing this and blow out some gutters. So included in the kit, you do get four pieces of 20 inch tubes. And these are gonna be your extensions. I'm assuming this is gonna be very easy to assemble, which it is. One piece into another. Is it pretty light? So far it's one piece is light, but it's starting to gain weight. Now one reason that I did want Toro to send this out to me is because I have very high gutters and I am extremely, extremely afraid of heights. So this is going to come in handy for cleaning out my gutters. Can you see that whole tube? Okay, so we are going to start off with the Toro 60 volt flex force battery operated blower. Uh, it does come with three different tips. This one's for a blower vac. And these two here specifically say that they are universal mounts. Uh, the flex tube right here, this is for if for some reason you need a flexible joint in any of these, you can put this flex joint in between there and you'll get a little bit of movement out of your shaft. So I'm gonna find out which one fits on to here properly. That one's a little loose. That one's way loose. That one's way loose. So, is there any zip ties included? Looky there. So there is a zip tie that is included that's going to wrap up on top of here. And one thing about these reviews, I like to do them without instructions just to show you guys how easy or hard these are to install. Because some of this stuff is kind of common sense and some things just need a little work. Yeah, so this is uh, super easy. You just install the, the zip tie portion on here and tighten it up. And although that could be snugged up a little bit more, it looks like it's kind of hard to get tight tight. Yeah, it is kind of hard to get tight tight. Uh, so anyway, now this is installed on here. 
we can put the rest of our tube guy probably should have installed that <laughs> that's where your flex tube goes all right well here we go that's <laughs> I, that's why i like to install these things without instructions just to see if they're difficult or not so i'm going to put the flex tube right here and it will screw on and then we will put that onto the actual tube itself So even though it is quite a bit awkward right now, this is 100 times safer than being up on the roof and cleaning them by yourself. So as you can see, you got the blower, the flex tube, and then the gutter mount itself. So let's go dip this in the gutter. And actually what I'm, what I'm most concerned about is if the air is actually gonna make it from the blower all the way up to the top with enough force to blow out these gutters. Here, let's see. <laughs> it just fell right off all right so when you get frustrated you learn some new things this hose was coming off because this ratchet was not getting tight enough so i did learn something as i was wondering why it wasn't staying on very good so i showed you earlier that all you do is put this on here and ratchet it tight now it's just like a zip tie so I did not know until after messing around with some things, all you have to do is lift this silver letter, lever up and now you're actually ratcheting this thing tight. So it's super, super tight. And uh, to get this off, all you have to do is push down on the back side, and that will release all of the pressure and now you can take it back off. So let's ratchet this thing tight so it doesn't fall off this time. Okay, so you saw in the first part of the gutter there, it cleaned the gutters out with no problem. Now I'm not up there and I don't know if it blew out like the sand from your shingles or anything like that, but it definitely blew out all the dry leaves. So I know that this portion of the gutter is cleaned out. So with blowing all of those leaves out of there, I don't know if you saw that, but some of those leaves, they kind of washed out and went on top of the roof. So you probably will have to go back uh, several times during the leaf season, especially if you are under trees like this area right here. So now that we got that cleaned out, I'm gonna stick the hose up here onto this downspout. And this downspout comes all the way down and runs out over here. We shove some leaves in there. And I'm gonna see just how much power, if this can actually run down the gutter and out this tube. So no excuses or anything. That is all gonna depend on the amount of power and wind volume that is coming out of your unit. And we're dealing with 10 foot, 20 foot, almost 30 foot of hose. That's gonna take a lot more than just a battery powered uh, leaf blower to do all of that. But if you could see, there was quite a bit of wind coming out of the end of that, just not enough to blow all of that out of the end of it. I got an idea. Let's try it with another blower. Good. All right, so we did see that it fit the Toro, but it is a Toro product. But as the box says, it is a universal gutter cleaning kit. Let's see how universal this actually is. I do have a Milwaukee fuel brushless right here. Uh, okay, first of all, it does fit on here. It's a little bit large, but we do have the zip tie on here that is capable of ratcheting. Ah, 
and I got quite a bit of ratcheting force on there. And of course, so far, so good. All right, so we got two battery powers out of the way. Now this one right here is probably what most of the people is gonna be using this for. Let's see if I can get this heated and misshapen piece off of here. Put this on here and it is, oh my gosh, look at the difference right here. I got a lot of gap to close up on this, but we will see if it can handle it. I'm gonna say no. That's... It's not, it's not gonna work on this, but we do have a commercial grade backpack blower right here. This is a steel BR800C, top of the line in the backpack blowers. So let's unclip this one. Okay, so this is as big as they come. Um, is there any way? I'm just gonna see if without the extension on here. You can't take it off. If this will fit. If you had a tube this big, this diameter right here would still fit around this tube right here. And I think we're looking at close to four inch of uh, diameter right here. So I'm gonna reinstall this here real quick. All right, so it does come with a very large adapter right here, which is gonna be entirely too big for this. And fortunately, the one that fits the Toro and the Milwaukee, well, it's gonna fit, but it's still a little bit too small for this. All right, so I got that little tip off of there. Now we have a little bit larger, and that looks like that's actually gonna work a lot better. So the zip tie, let's put the zip tie on it. Okay, so as far as universal fit, now I do have the extension hose out here for the gutters, but guys, we're, we're hooked onto a commercial grade backpack blower here, which is somewhere in the round uh, 20 pounds, I'm guessing. So this is fitted to the hose. I'm lifting 20 pounds, which is that connected to the top. So. I'm not even going to demonstrate this being on here. This has an unbelievable amount of airflow that comes out of here. And even with this squish down, you're going to get a lot more CFM and MPH coming out of the tip of this. You're not going to believe me unless I show you. Let's hook this up and get some leaves blown. <laughs> all right this is this is silly and cumbersome uh it's a backpack blower i don't think that it's meant to go on here i'm going to set the camera down and show you just how much force is still going to come out of here <coughs>
I think the old 800C might be a little too much. <laughs> I'm not even going to demonstrate the gutters with that. As you can see, this is this is top of the line. You're not going to get any bigger than this uh, commercial grade mower. But as you can see with the Milwaukee and the Toro, and actually this, it is a universal gutter cleaning kit. You can put it almost anything, especially with the ratcheting zip tie. Awesome function on that. I'm glad I found out that ability. But for not being up on the roof, guys, it's a cheap, cheap investment to get a gutter cleaning kit. Uh, I do appreciate Toro for sending that out to me. I better get this still off my back while I say that. <laughs> but uh, anyways, yes, I do appreciate everything that they send me out to review. And just like in every other video, every product they send me surprises me that it works just as they say it does. So again, a very cheap product for your insurance to stay off of your roof clean your gutters out that way in the winter time when the water comes down it doesn't clog up turn into ice bust your gutters all up and all whatever happens uh, your gutters need to be cleaned anyways guys I hope this video brought you a little bit of comedy first of all and a little bit of information if it did guys hit that like button hit the subscribe button leave a comment down below I will see you in the next one Monday, Monday, Tuesday, Tuesday, Wednesday, 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 Thursday, Thursday. I just dream of fishing while I'm going through my work day. I listen to my boss, though he's driving me berserk. Eh? Damn it, I can't take much more because my brain is really hurting. And now the bank is always calling and I don't know what to do. And I haven't bought a crankbait since like 1992. But the bass are out there schooling.